Dang, college. There's a movie called College. Man, that shit was fun. Nobody saw it. We was in New Orleans, like for, for six weeks, man. It was, a, it was a college. The problem with that movie is we came out like two weeks after Super Bad, and we had the same characters. We had a fat guy. We had a fucking nerd. We had a goofy dog. Like fuck, man. But man, that was fun. Cause uh, I got really cool with Vern on that movie. Uh, uh, you know, Mini Me. Cause I was Bear Cat. He was Bear Kitten. We was partners. And then we, we 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 ran this. Fray. If you ain't seen it, we basically ran this frat house. We was mean to all the fucking kids at the frat house, and I was like some dirty year old that never graduated. <laughs> I just hung out at the frat house. But man, we it was fun because they won. I think they hired every stripper in New Orleans because it was rated R's. So there was titty every day, titty there were. Now you get a, when you see a lot of titties. The first day it was like cool, but after about the fifth day, like. <laughs> but Vern was funny, man, because I didn't know he really needed that cart to get around. That little cart he had. So like one night we got fucked up, man, and I took his cart and stole it. And I was I was riding down Bourbon Street, Urgh! stopped and got fucking hurricanes. Came back an hour later, Burr's sitting there, like four in the morning. Hey, asshole! I can't fucking leave without it. I go, oh shit, you really needed to get around? I thought you were just being lazy. <laughs> he was just by himself. <laughs> asshole! What the fuck, dude? I'm sorry. <laughs> Burr was the best, man. Because he would get you in everywhere. He's like, he's like fucking an ornament. Like, it, it don't matter what club, what party, you got burned, you was getting in that motherfucker, man. We be at some crazy shit. The strip clubs was the best with Vern. Because the strippers would go nuts on that motherfucker like he was a Tootsie Pop. Pick him up and lick that motherfucker. <laughs> what the fuck? Are they licking your head? I know, man, it's crazy. I had so much fun with that motherfucker, man. He's always going to my shows and shit. We got cool on that movie, man. That sucks when he passed away, man. That was my dude. We had a good time in New Orleans, though. It was fun, man. That was probably my, that was the best one. Think Like a Man 2 was good because we was in Vegas. And we was all, you know, I just I just go where Kevin was and just drink for free. And <laughs> Kev, where you at? I'll show up. Because I always went by myself. Because I was like, you travel light, you travel right. You show up to shit, you by yourself. Motherfuckers always let you in and hang out. You start showing up with the crew. You're like, mm -hmm. that's too many motherfuckers, man. Because everybody made fun of me because I was always by myself everywhere. Everywhere. They be like, I remember one time we was in LA. First time I ever hung out with, we started thinking like I meant one. Everybody lived in LA but me. So I was the only one from out of town. So everybody else like, Ugh. clubs there, I didn't know where to go. So Terrence J and his right hand man Fred, they was the party people. And Megan Good was, they, they would go, Megan and and Terrence was the party motherfuckers. I think I remember one, because that was 10 years ago. And I just remember Terrence, the first night I ever hung out with him, I was like, yo, I'm gonna meet you guys at the club, okay? It was fucking like 500 black people trying to get in this club, and I'm in the middle by myself. I'm texting Terrence, like, motherfucker, I'm outside, come get me, I'm outside. And then Fred came out, his right hand, he's out there, he goes, Gary, yeah. I'm waving at him. He's like doing this shit, he's like, who's with you? I said, I'm by myself. He goes, who the fuck goes to a nightclub by themselves? I was like, motherfucker, travel light, travel right. I remember, and then I had to, all the black people had to move, and I had to get them to, sorry, 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 sorry. I'm very sorry about this. Fire marshal, sorry. Fire marshal, sorry. You know, black people be mad. Motherfucker, I've been here in 45 motherfucking minutes. What the fuck this motherfucker going in for? Fire marshal. That shit was funny. Terrence, I mean, Fred kept pointing, who's with you, who's with you? I said, nobody, motherfucker, but myself. This is a little piece of salt amongst all that pepper. All right, anybody else got anything you want to ask? You guys really got questions in the middle of the night. Shit. You <laughs> heard first. Talking about. It's funny, we became friends because of that. Me and Joseph. Like we we are really good friends because I would always I kept getting stopped and then he was getting stopped. Like motherfucker be like, man, you funny as fuck. And Joseph's like, what the fuck you mean I'm funny as fuck? I just killed my mama. 
I just killed my mom last night. How the fuck is that funny? <laughs> no, nah, man, that shit you said, he was like, we start DMing, we really start DMing. That's how we got cool. It's crazy. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, there's worse motherfuckers you compare it to. <laughs> but before Tommy came along, motherfuckers always said I looked like Biff from Back to the Future. <laughs> I was like, thank God for power. Man, you look like Biff from back in the day. <laughs> and he couldn't get mad because then I looked more like him. What the fuck you say? <laughs> Damn, you really act like him, too. <laughs> thank God for Tommy, man. 